after learning about how uh, the IB program changed so many students, it's one of the most rigorous programs in the world. I actually want to partake in it to, to see how capable I am for the future in college and to find like a job to be a doctor. Well, UCF is primarily my first choice because it's closer to my parents. It's like a family tradition of going to UCF. UCF for me is just phase one. For medical school, I kind of want to travel, go more abroad. I like working with kids. I, my mom would say I have a gift with kids. I'm planning um, to take biomedical sciences to become a uh, pediatrician. But however, I do want to progress and pursue other careers, maybe like an ophthalmologist because I have glaucoma. For since I was five or six years old, it's not a common thing since I'm very young, but there's no cure, so I might as well add me to the equation to actually find a cure. My sister is really the person that got me through my glaucoma and, and education and social life and everything else. I had to realize that I weren't like any other kids. I couldn't see well. With that obstacle in mind, I kind of adapted to weightlifting. So I think it really helped me shape me to become a stronger person, physically and mentally. Mr. Morrison, he is a photography teacher. Over the years, he's given me advice on like what to do in college and usually have lunch with him too, so it's really fun. For this, this is my cast project, so it's a combination of creative and um, service. And I know I'm not the best artist. I really want to showcase my skill as a person. I decided to do top 30 influential faces. I like how diverse Winter Park is and I want to portray that on this wall. All my clubs are basically community service based. They really impacted me to help others in a way that maybe isn't the biggest way, but maybe the smallest steps from everybody else could make a big difference.